My father passed away on the 11th day of 2017 of esophageal cancer. He finally lays in peace. I pray daily for him to have an altruistic rebirth in which he is a soul of very compassionate nature. I've been battling healing struggles and sibling rivalry attacks that started off subtle in early stages and then suddenly got to be too disturbing to address or deal with while I was being made to feel guilty for not wanting to see a father who had been so utterly insolent that he was toxic to all who came in contact with his negativity, which eventually burnt him from his over-acidic interstitial condition. In 2016, I was able to make more headway into figuring out how I was going to adjust and heal myself from erosive esophagus and prevent myself from getting esophageal cancer too. Because I had suffered almost 18 years from hyponatremia and other digestive disorders, along with anxiety, vitamin D deficiency, and many more issues. I found myself fighting for my own life, which is what I set out to do. My fruit and plant-based, high carbohydrate and low fat diet and active ethical vegan lifestyle had given me some very good results, but I still had many unresolved health issues that I had to deal with. I had no time for social media. It was time for me to take care of my nervous system, my lymphatic, my adrenal and digestive system. I dove into yoga, meditation, and more research about how to do my own deeper healing so I did not wind up dying of full-blown acidification. Investigation and investigating uh, the truth takes time and so does true healing. So I've done a lot of looking within with much self-introspection, meditation, sunning and eating a lot of yummy fruit and fresh herbs and veggies straight from Susan's organic garden and have gotten many positive results but I understand my body still needs yet a lot more deeper cleansing so I leave you with this I'm sorry that I'm not on here a lot but I am on here I do pay attention at least once a week I'm gonna try to be in here I will post stuff and I will look for friends and I'll say hello and I, I know I've made new friends and I'd like to say hello to some of you and see what you're, you've are you been up to. And for now, I bid you namaste love and blessings for the very best of true healing and truly good health.